Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I have a Bath & Body Works collective haul and an unboxing that I'm going to be doing in this video. So I wanted to mention I'm not trying to brag in any way, shape, or form. I just love watching these type of videos. I've said this many times, but I figure I would say that disclaimer just because I want you guys to know. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and jump right in and show you guys what I got. I also wanted to mention this bag on this side is a one transaction. This is another transaction and then... I have two separate orders I did online, which like I said, I'm going to be unboxing in this video. So just to let you guys know, I did not buy all of this at once. And I'm going to go ahead and start with this bag on this side. So the first thing that I had in that bag is a candle. And I'm going to be unwrapping it because it was still wrapped. I had been waiting a while to do this video because I wanted to do it all together and not just make small videos. So that's why. But... The candle that I have is this Relax Lavender Vanilla Aromatherapy Candle. And it says, Take Time to Rest, Lavender Essential Oil and Vanilla Absolute. And this one is a first for me. I have not, I had not gotten one of these candles because I wasn't sure if I liked it. And the one that I've been grabbing <clears throat> was the Stress Relief Eucalyptus Tea Candle, which that one is my favorite. I love how it smells. So I decided to go ahead and just get it because I had been wanting to get it for a while, but I just wasn't sure. And then, so yeah, I got it. And basically, um, I would describe the scent exactly like, I don't know if it's baby powder, but it, to me it just smells like baby, sh like baby shampoo or baby powder. It's exactly like that. So I only got one. And then in the bottom, it just says made with lavender essential oil and vanilla absolute. So... I really love this candle, but like I said, I've only gotten one. And the next thing that I'm going to show you guys is in the Aroma Therapy line as well. So those are still wrapped too. So I got two of the Stress Relief Eucalyptus Tea Body Lotions, and those are uh, the description says. Keep your calm, soothing eucalyptus essential oil and tea help calm feelings of stress and uncertainty. So like I've said, this one is my favorite scent in the aroma therapy line. So I decided to get the body lotions and I saw the body creams, but I figured I would like more the texture of the body lotion. Um, and I've heard that the body lotion lasts longer than a body cream. So that's why I got these. And then the back says the ultra creamy nourishing body lotion is formulated to give skin long lasting moisture while an aromatherapy blend of essential oil helps calm feelings of stress and uncertainty and this one i don't know how i would describe the scent it just smells like roses or flowers to me so i really love that and i think that was everything that i got in this bag so moving on to the next bag um that i have to say something before because I don't know if it's by the time I film this, it's probably going to be pretty pre recorded. So I'm pretty sure this collection will be out. But I got some of the stuff from the Tutti Dolce collection. And basically, they have four new scents. But my favorite one was the. Let me see, because I want to make sure I'm not saying the wrong name. But I love the White Mocha Kiss. That's the scent that I really liked. And I have to say that. Uh, many people were saying that basically White Mocha Kiss was a replacement or like the same as Beach Nights. And I have to say that I do definitely agree because I absolutely became obsessed with Beach Nights when I bought it during the semi-annual sale. So if you guys missed out on the Beach Nights and you, went and you wanted to get it, I would say for you guys to go and try and smell the White Mocha Kiss from the Turi Dolce line. And I'm pretty sure you guys are going to like it. It smells exactly the same to me. Except the only thing I would say, the fragrance mist on the Tutti Dolce line, I can definitely see a little difference. I can see the similarity, but I feel there's a difference in the scent, so that's why I only got one fragrance mist. And I did want to mention it because I know some people were kind of bummed out that they weren't able to get the beach nights during the semi-annual sale, but yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you guys what I got from that line. So the first thing that I got were some of the Tutti Dolce White Mocha Kiss body creams. And this is what the packaging looks like. And then the back, the description says, 
white mocha kiss, rich vanilla mocha, and coconut orchid wrapped in marshmallow cream. So I can also say that it had some of the same description notes as the Beach Nights. And just to compare, I'll show you guys to what the Beach Nights description was. So the keynotes on this one are toasted marshmallow, sea salt breeze, s'mores accord, beach driftwood, and creamy vanilla. So if you guys compare the Tutti Dolce with the uh, Beach Nights, basically they both say something about marshmallow and vanilla. And I'm pretty sure, no, the other one doesn't say anything about coconut, but there's the marshmallow and the vanilla. So I could definitely see why it smells the same. So yeah, and then I'm pretty sure I got more of the body creams. Because the body creams did smell exactly the same. The only one is the fragrance mist that I saw a little difference. So I got three Turi Dolce body creams from the scent White Mocha Kiss. And then I got two of the shower gels because I was only able to get one Beach Nights shower gel during the semi-annual sale. And the packaging looks way different, but I'm not convinced yet whether I do like it or not. I definitely like the older packaging. Some people might like the new packaging, but I don't know. It seems fine. I don't know. And yeah, basically that's what the packaging looks like. It's the same scent and the description is going to be the same. So two shower gels, three of the body creams, and I have one of the Tutti Dolce fragrance mist. Where's the... Okay, that's what... I definitely like the older packaging, or like, not the older packaging, but the different, sometimes they have a better packaging on some of these items, so, but anyways, I needed to get it, so, yeah. So I only got one fragrance mist, like I said, and then the last thing that I have in this bag is a free item that I was able to get, and this is the French Lavender Honey Shower Gel. So this, I had a coupon for a free item and this is what I got. And then the fragrance notes on this, I'm not sure if it says it on the bottle. No, it, it doesn't, but it smells really good. It smells like citrusy. And then as you guys can see, I'm actually burning a stress relief eucalyptus tea back there. And it smells really good. I'm actually getting to the bottom of it already. It's like right there. Anyways... The other thing that I'm going to move on to is the unboxing. So I'm going to try to make some space because it's not going to fit on the screen. Okay, so I'm going to start with the smaller box. So this is what the box looks like. And I'm pretty sure this is from the winter. I got some stuff from the winter collection. So. so this is the paper that says what I bought. Then there's all this junk. Oh, and then there's a coupon, the usual coupon that you guys get. So this is a 20% of your online order. And yes, what I had been waiting for, my favorite winter scent. I got four of the winter candy apple shower gels. You guys know this was one of my favorites during the winter. And the keynotes are red apple, winter rose, petals, candied orange, maple leaf, fresh cinnamon, so happy that I was able to get four because I know that I tried to order some of these um, a while ago. I think I tried to order two of them and then the order was canceled. They said that they were out of stock. So I was like, if I order it again, they might say the same thing. But I still gave it a try and it definitely worked out. So I had to stock up just in case. And so I got four of these. Whoa. But this is what they look like sure you guys have seen the same packaging over and over again and yeah that is everything that I got for this first online order and I'm gonna try to tell you guys how much I paid in total so my total amount for this online order was $16.92 and each of the shower gels were $2.40 so that was definitely a good price 
and then for shipping was six dollars and tax was 133 so it wasn't that bad because i know sometimes i really don't like ordering online just because of how much i pay for shipping but anyways i'm moving on to some other stuff so that was my first online order and then finally i'm moving on to the last items that i have to show you guys so this is a bigger box and then i'm pretty sure i ordered some candles in here so once again the receipt the same trash and another coupon they always put coupons in here okay so I'll just start with this one so this one I think yeah I only got all of them were candles so I'm gonna try to move this a little to the side to make some space so basically this is the first candle that I got I'm really surprised that they actually didn't come broken like in one of my last hauls I was really disappointed because I wanted I expected more but they came broken and I had to fix it. So I got the Stress Relief Eucalyptus Tea Scented Candle. Like I said, it's one of my favorites. And I am burning it currently. And this one, it just says the same description as the body lotions. But it says, made with eucalyptus essential oil and tea. So, yeah. And then moving on to my last two candles of this haul. Um, I got them in the same scent and let me show you guys I got vanilla snowflake which I regretted not getting before so I decided to give it a try and just get two of these and yes and as you guys can see it's kind of a little messed up the wax there's like little pieces of wax around there but I don't mind and so the description for this one is it says keynotes are creamy vanilla iced fur wintry mint coconut flakes so this one is a new one for me um i know i got it during the candle sale or something like that but i wanted to get two more and see how they worked out with the burn and everything the scent i would describe as vanilla a little coconut i don't know it definitely it does smell good and the packaging, I can't get over how cute the winter packaging was for these candles. I love, definitely love them. So yeah, this is one of them. And then there's another one that I got. So this is the last one. Same thing. And that's what it looks like. So basically that sums up this haul. Um, these are all the things that I got for this online order and I hope you guys enjoyed this Bath & Body Works collective haul and excuse my baby brother if you guys can hear him in the background but yeah basically this is everything and I hope you guys enjoyed this video please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and comment and subscribe if you're not subscribed already and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys